Hello, today I'm going to show you how to replace cells using Calibre Design Ref. We will always get the newer version of the block or a newer version of the IP throughout the entire table process. It is required to create a database that contains the most up-to-date IPs or cells. So we can use it to run physical verification to make sure it is DRC clean. In this particular example, I got a new version of the NIN cell for the design. And in this new version of the cell, is this add a separate GDS file, it's called NIN.GDS. And this new version of the NIN cell has a new logo on top of it. Now, let me show you how easy it is to replace the old NAND cell with this new one. You click on File, then choose File Merge, because this is the latest and the fastest of all the methods I can use in DesignRep to do this operation. Then it opens up a GUI to ask you to choose your input and output databases. The first tab contains all the required settings for you to run this operation. As you can see, there are four different merge modes in the lower left corner. In this case, you need to use the override mode to replace the cell in the design. After you enter all the required settings in the first tab, then you can go to the second tab to see all the advanced options for this feature. In this case, I choose to open the layout when merge completes, so the merge database will be automatically loaded afterwards. Then I click Run Merge. When the merge finishes, I close the current GUI and examine the results in Design Ref. I can easily tell that the NAND cell has been placed with a new one at old cell location. Today, I showed you how you can replace cells using Calibre Design Ref in a GUI. This option is also available from the batch command line. You can use the GUI to choose the settings, then click Save Command, then run it directly from the command line. This is Sound of Pain. Hope this is helpful. Thank you.